Welcome to Module 11, Lesson 3. You're going to go to page 256. Our I can statement reads, I can draw a model and write an equation to show how I break apart an add end to make the next tens number. This is very similar to what we did in our first lesson of this module. We're just going to be using larger add ends now. Let's look at our build understanding. Timothy has 37 red apples and 17 green apples. How many red apples does he have? How can we draw to show this problem? Let's go ahead and use tens. So he has 37, so three tens and seven ones of the red apples and 17 one ten and seven ones of the green apples. Now on our drawing, we're gonna show how to get to the next tens number. So looking at our first add end, our first add end is 37. How many more do we need to get to the next 10? We have three tens and seven ones, so we need three more ones. So let's answer letter C. How many do we have to add to 37 to get to the next tens number? We need to add three ones. So then we'll complete our equation. 37 plus 17. In our drawing, we saw that we needed three more to get to the next tens place. Then we would have four tens or 40. When I decompose or break apart 17 to 3, I have how many remaining? You can look it back at your picture to see. You should have found that you have 14 remaining. We know that 3 plus 37 is 40 because it'll get us to our next tens number. Then we'll add our 14. Well, we can use our understanding of place value to know that 14 is 10 and 4. 110 more than 40 is 50. Plus 4 more is 54. So we know in total, Timothy has 54 apples. Let's look at our next problem. Sam has 28 books. Kyle has 16 books. How many books do they have? So let's show Sam's books. He has 28 or two tens and eight ones. Kyle has 16 books or one ten and six ones. Let's think about how many to get to the next tens. We know we have two tens, so in order to have three, we need two more. Let's show our equation. 28 plus 16. We broke 16 into two, and then how many more? two and 14. We know our next tens number will be when we add our two ones. Our next tens is 30. Then we need to add our remaining 14. I know that one ten greater than 30 is 40 and four ones greater than 40 is 44. So in total, they have 44 books. Now it's time for you to complete the check understanding. Zoe has 29 red beads and 22 blue beads. How many beads does Zoe have? First, you'll draw the problem here. 
showing her number of red beads and her number of blue beads. Then you'll complete the equation. We know that we're adding our 29 red beads plus our 22 blue beads. You'll show how you break apart 22 to make the next 10. Go ahead and solve. the video if you need any more time. So if we look at how many red beads there are, we know that we just need one more to get us to the next tens number. So 29 plus 1. Well, one less than 22 is 21. So I get, tw when I have 29 plus one more, my next tens is 30. Then I'll add my remaining 21. Two tens greater than 30 is 50. Plus one more is 51. So I know that there are 51 beads 